look to throw here on first down. Eluding the pressure right. Give him nine on the play, and it'll be second and about a yard. And it looks like this will likely be the last play before we hit the two-minute warning. Let's see if they can sneak one more good play in before the two-minute signal. We remind you that coming up at halftime, we'll pay a visit to Larry Ridley in Orlando with our EA Sports Halftime Report. And the eighth play on this drive coming up. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. No, oh, he almost had it. Already with one interception, just missing his second there. Ninth play coming up here on this drive. This is third and a yard. They'll look to throw for it on third and one. Flush to his right. And he can't find anywhere to go with it. And he goes down. set to take the field. And they split the uprights last time for three. They've got the lead. Right, they're go. not going to play this conservative. They're not hoping for another field goal. They're hoping. And now this is intercepted. My goodness. And some room to run now. The 20. And they will finally get him, but not until he's all the way down inside the 15-yard line. Well, that's a drive killer right now. Broncos offensive unit ready to head back out onto the field. And we'll see how this is played. Offensively, they got the lead. Not a whole lot of time left. What do you think, Charles? Well, it's tempting to try and add to your lead, but a mistake there, that could change things in a big way. I say go ahead, take the knee, get on out for the half. So here we go, first and 10 now. Looked like the defense put pretty good pressure on him, but he's able to flush out to his right to try and evade people. On the run, had to get on his horse. Still accurately throws a nice pass for a first down. Unable to connect on the first down pass play. Now it's second down. All right, here we go. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. Flushed out right. And to the 42-yard line here and brought down there. Give him seven on the play. And all of a sudden here, it's third down. Well, he's proven real effective running the football. No one open, don't force it. Just get what you can. And that's what he's done very well in this game. Looking to throw. Escaping the pressure right. And for the third time here in this half, it's intercepted. Picked off by the safety here, Rod Parker. take a glance at the offense as they work their way back out for their first possession of the second half. They were able to get the ball back here, didn't surrender any points. Nowhere to escape, and he goes down. Justin Houston in there to get him, and that's sack number 18 for him on the year. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. Completes it to Norwood. It'll be a gain of 15 on the play, and that's going to lead to a third down. So here we go, a third down after the second down pass completion. Thomas, the lone receiver left. Back to throw here, and incomplete. The contact made the ball roam free and brings up fourth down. coming out now and they're coming off a three and out my friend I think they've got to look at that play sheet and go to a spot that they haven't gone before time to shake things up a little bit to try and get this offense moving okay so how do you do that how do you shake things up you look at what you've called before and realize it hasn't worked go to something somewhere. else and maybe you try and find one of those special plays from one of your better players and maybe try and hit something big and get things going in the excitement area They'll set up a throw, and his pass is intercepted for the fourth time today. A great read, and it's picked off. And the possession is theirs at their own. Here's the 
Here's the Denver offense now as they get set to take over here. And following the interception, just any interception, are you a little bit more cautious when you start that next drive, or no, you just throw that out the window? And I think the ball's out, but this will get out of bounds, so possession will stay the same. I don't know about you, but I can hear and feel the sigh of relief all the way up here in our booth. That yeah, was palpable. The sideline, the friend there. No doubt about it. Ball goes over the sideline, able to retain possession, no turnover. <laughs> I know his coaches are screaming, just hang on to the ball, man. It'll go as a gain of six that time, and it moves the chains as well. Offense comes to the line now, first and ten. Well, that's a nice job right there. He's looking downfield, but with no one open, he takes off and tries to run for it. He gets to the sidelines and gets out of bounds with a first down. And he's able to take this one up to the 35-yard line. Call it a gain of three, and it'll be a second down. So many times you hear today's NFL described as a space game. Get your best players into space with the football in their hands. That's why sometimes you just swing it out to your runner, get him out in the flat, and let him have a chance to make people miss an open field. It's a 10-yard pickup, and it moves the chains. Thomas, the lone receiver left. They'll look to throw now on first down, eluding the pressure right. Ten yards on the pick up there, and it'll be first down Denver. to Denver. It's been a very hotly contested game to this point. Just a field goal separating these two teams as we get set for the fourth quarter. They'll look to throw here on first down. And nearly another interception. They've been around the ball all game. So incomplete on first. Let's see what second down has in store. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. His throw incomplete. Here comes the eighth play of the drive, and they need a full 10 yards on third down. And the Chiefs showing a dime look as they defend this third down. They'll look to throw here. On the right side, caught by Green. That one good for 10 yards. And it'll be... The Broncos offense now gets ready to head back onto the field. They had a great drive going last time. They were moving the ball, and then all of a sudden it just stalled out. So we'll see what they can do here, Charles. And it's always easy to second guess when you don't get it on a fourth down try. But they had to like the feeling that they had going on offense. They want to continue to see if they can capture that again on this drive and maybe get in the same position. Yeah, and that's, I mean, like I said, they were moving the football. It's not like they went four and out, so I don't think it's a, a deal where the offense doesn't have confidence. No, I agree with you totally on that one. If, if anything, they may have gained more confidence. Okay, they stopped us once. That's all right. Let's keep moving it. Make them do it again. Thomas, the lone receiver left. Back to throw now on first down. And this is Latimer, complete. And he's brought down. A solid pickup of 13 sets him up first and goal. And the defense with their backs against the wall a little bit here as the offense is in the red zone. They'll look to throw again. Buying time to his left. And no escaping this time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. Justin Houston in there for the sack, and he's closing in on that all-time record. That's number 19 on the year. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw, and his throw is incomplete. So they're behind the chains is the offense. 12 yards needed on third down. Now they'll throw here, out of the gun. And he is into the end zone for a Denver touchdown. Jordan Norwood, his fifth touchdown now on the year. And the Broncos will extend. And coming out now, the Broncos. 
goes. And they will simply, Charles, be looking to duplicate what they did last drive when they were able to push it in for six. And they hope it'll... And intercepted! Maybe the turning point they need! A great read, and it's picked off! And a big... And now the Broncos offense, they get set to head back onto the field. They've got the lead by three, late stages of the game. What's the message here? Just hang on to the football, is it that simple? And he can't get a throw off, he's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. In the slot on the right is Graham. They'll drop to throw. Wide open receiver complete. 17 yards on the pickup. And they're going to have a third down. Three yards left to grab here on third down. In recent years, the slot receivers really gained stature in the NFL because they can do so many things. Yes, they can line up wide like your normal wide receiver, but they have that kind of courage and toughness to run routes in the middle of the field and become dependable targets for their quarterbacks and move the sticks. Those guys are worth their weight in gold. Thomas, the lone receiver left. That one looks like he'll throw here. And he gets it complete to Latimer. They'll get 16 yards there. And it's a first down for the Broncos. They'll look to throw now on first down. And look at this. They get the turnover they needed. It's intercepted. Picked off by Derek Jones. Denver getting set to take the field. They have the three-point lead. Defense did their job. Now, late game. Although it looks good, you know the coaches, they haven't counted this as a victory yet. I agree with you totally. Big applause for the defense, but no one is taking their headset off on the sidelines. They don't believe this game is over. The offense has to close this one out by taking care of the football. And they'll try to close it out now. And I know it's hard in live action, but you've got to keep your hands away from the face. That's a 15-yard penalty. You work on it all the time, making sure your target area is lower and trying to keep your hands away from the face mask so you don't get the big penalty. Dance into his left. Give him 10 yards on the pickup, and that'll bring up a second and goal. And play is stopped here. Timeout. It's the defense calling the timeout here. That'll be their third and final stoppage here as we step aside. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. And this is caught. And that could seal it. It's a touchdown. In order to lead in the game, you're going to get plenty of contributors. But that's his second touchdown catch of this game. He's one of the key guys in this one. And you better believe he'll be looking for the hat trick here as this one continues to go. And there's going to be a stoppage here. The booth wants to take another look at this potential touchdown. Thomas, the lone receiver left. He'll look to throw. Now oh, there's that man again. It's complete. And he's brought down. So that'll do it for my partner, Charles Davis, and the best darn crew in the industry. I'm Brandon Gaughton. This has been a presentation of the NFL on EA Sports.
The Broncos are winners as we say so long from 